What's up guys, CO Liquid here, back with another video. So today I was going to jump in and talk about uh, Head Unit Reloaded. I did a video on Android Auto Cool Walk uh, about a week ago and I thought I'd just show you how I set mine up in my car. Um, I use Head Unit Reloaded. It's an app you can download from Google Play Store. Uh, they have a trial version so you can download it to your head unit and see if you like it. Uh, and if you do, buy the full version. Um, I use the full version. I paid for it, so it's um, definitely worth it. I get plenty of use out of it. the trial version. You only get a certain amount of time, then it like boots you out of it. So you have to keep going in and out. So if you like it and think you want to keep using it, then I would definitely recommend the paid version. It's a pay one time. It's not a subscription or anything. So definitely worth it. Um, so let's jump in here. Um, I got my Pixel 7 Pro here that I'm going to plug in. Open the head unit reloaded app. Once you get it installed, you see you have some options here. Um, you'll see these options as far as the settings when the phone is unplugged. When you plug the phone in, then normally you don't see these. So you want to change the settings in here before you plug the phone in, or at least that's what I would recommend. Um, underneath settings, you have options for you know, auto, day, night, or night all the time, or day all the time. You have stuff for changing your microphone sampling rate, microphone buffering, enable HUD mirroring, like if you have your phone plugged in and you have your phone laying flat, then it'll give you like a perspective of the phone laying flat also, or the screen laying flat also, which I don't know why you would use that, but hey, it's there if you want it. Uh, this is the resolution. My particular head unit has a 1280 by 720 um, aspect ratio, or not aspect ratio, but uh, resolution. So I keep mine set on that. Sometimes I'll put it on 1920 by 1080. I mean, even though it, my screen doesn't um, do that resolution, it seems like it makes it a little clearer. Um, actually, I think I'll switch that. Well, no, I'll leave it on. Um, but pixel density is the one that I wanted to show you. Just, uh, one in here that you want to change if you don't like the layout of Android Auto so that's the one I want to show you right now by default mine is set to 165 as you can see there but let's jump back out of this go back out so let me plug my phone in I'm using my Pixel 7 Pro here so try and do this one handed alright so plug the phone in and it should come right up. Um, my phone's got bad signal right now, so it's running a little slow, but should come right up. And you see, I have my music here on the right hand side, map here on the left. You can click on Google Maps uh, icon over here, and it takes up the whole screen. And you can click back down here in the corner, this little icon. If I can click it, I'm looking through the camera screen here, uh, and then it'll bring everything back up. You can also click on your music app, and it'll slide that over and make it the big screen and make the map small over here. And then just click the map again, and it'll flip it back over. Um, I have Waze on here. Waze does work in this perspective right here, where you have the map on the left and your music on the right but you're not able to full screen it like you are with Google Maps. You can't do this with Waze right now. Uh, I guess they haven't optimized Waze to work with it, uh, work with Cool Walk yet, so you can only do this with the uh, Google Maps. And also if you move your app over, or move your music app over, over here on the side, if this was Waze, you would just see a Waze icon. You would not see the map like you see here. So yeah, they need to fix the uh, ways working with that I mean this is obviously beta testing so I'm sure they'll get it working before they fully release it or at least I hope they would because a lot of people include myself use ways so um, so as you can see here there's the sidebar here on the left for all your icons so what I was going to show you as far as with the um, let me go out of this, go back to the home screen. What I was going to show you with head unit reloaded is once I unplug the phone here, go into head unit reloaded, 
go back to settings and then when you go to your pixel density here you can change this for mine seems like the sweet spot I want to say is 182 and then when I plug my phone back in here now as you can see the bar is no longer on the left it's down here at the bottom so it depends on how you like the layout some people like it with the uh, bar at the bottom because when you go full screen on your maps it does fill up the whole screen like it's not taken up here on the left side but then it's not as wide because now you have an, uh, a bar down here at the bottom so I mean it's six of one half a dozen the other but some people like it on the left or on or the test bar on the I can't speak today some people like the bar at the bottom some people like it on the left I I guess I kinda like it more on the left personally but I mean to each his own um, it still basically works the same everything else is the same as you can see when you click on that um, instead of sliding it over and then you have your maps on the side now it just gives you the whole um, presentation like it doesn't slide over and then the map goes to the right so that's another thing that's different I don't know why it does that or maybe it's just my head unit that it does that on but it doesn't give you that option for the side by side as you had on when the bar was on the left um, so that's basically all I wanted to show you um, if you're using head unit reloaded or if you thinking about using head unit reloaded that's where you go in and you change the pixel density and that's how you move the bar from the left side to the bottom so it's up to you to decide which one you like just play around with the pixel densities for your particular radio it may be different than the settings that I just did for mine but yeah that's pretty much it if you have any questions drop them in the comments um, if you like the video please like it helps a lot if you want to see more videos, please subscribe, and I will talk to you all later. Peace.